vegetation here in the north is even stranger than at home in Wasun. I must make a note. I wonder how the people in the city and the sea will react when they meet us. Don't worry, Hannah. They're human survivors of the 21st century shelters just like us. I'm sure they'll give us a splendid welcome. Here they come, Hammer. Let's give it to them. We're under attack. Turn the vehicles. Turn the vehicles. We're trapped. Wait for the order, Wrench. If you jump the gun, you'll foul up the ambush. Are you sure this antique is gonna work? Let's hope it doesn't blow up in our faces. This can't be happening. Jump! Ah! Whoa! <laughs> Chortis, you're hurt! I don't understand. The people in the city and the sea are supposed to be rebuilding civilization the same as us. They're not from the city and the sea. The fuel in the tires will be worth a fortune on the black market. It's Hammer Tahoon and his renegades. You have to go on, Hannah. Get to the city. Not without you. I'll only slow you down. Wasun must form an alliance with the city and the sea. It's the only hope for what's left of the human race. Hey, there's somebody over there. I'll try to lead them away from you. Go now! Hurry! In the 26th century, mankind faces an epic struggle for survival. The forces of nature have spun wildly out of control. Mighty cities have crumbled and the dinosaurs have returned to reclaim the Earth. In this savage land, one man stands alone, Jack Tenrack, defending humanity in a world gone mad. A world where only the strong survive. A world of Cadillacs and dinosaurs. We've had enough of your help, Tenrek. You know what did this to us? It was a giant shivet. A ship? That's impossible. They never come out of the foothills. No? See for yourself. Quahoon. You told us it was safe to build here. You said the shivets would never come down into the valley. We listened to you and your nonsense about the machinatio vitae. The machinery of life is a balance. We have to maintain it. Not at this price. This time we only lost our houses. What if next time it's our lives? The great beasts fear us as much as we fear them. It won't come back. And what if it does? Then... I'll destroy it. <laughs> hey! Ladies first. Huh? Oh. A 
hand grenade, huh? Some great weapons you got for a shard horse. Yes, Terhoon. And you'll get more as soon as Jack Tenrick is destroyed. And I mean destroyed. You can't just take out the man. You have to eliminate the Machinatio Vitae. Look, I risked my neck putting that gizmo on that shivet. And it worked great. Tore up that village real good. One village isn't enough. I need all the settlers in a panic so they'll forget about their loyalty to Tenrek and turn to me for protection. When you get what you want, remember, I get Tenrek's garage and everything in it. Of course, Hammer. Would I double-cross you? Not if you care about your future. <laughs> no. We need this scum alive for now. Get aboard, brothers. It's time for the Shivan to start rampaging again. Yeah! The city in the sea. It does exist. They seem to have technology, too. But has any of the old knowledge survived? New York Public Library. Bingo! Ah! <laughs> you, you sure scared me, little fella. <laughs> to destroy it. There's no other way. There is always another way. If you're dead, I can't say I'm sorry. If you're alive, on your feet. Oh, what, oh, what's going on here? It's an ambush, Slitherbrain. Like the one you and your friends set for my convoy. I don't know what you're talking about. Sure you don't. And I suppose you weren't following that shivet either. You are a poacher. A poacher? Lady, you couldn't be more wrong. My people have always been the arch enemies of the poachers. Your people? You mean in the city in the sea? No, my people, the old blood mechanics. You're lying. In Wasoon, all the old bloods have died off. Well, maybe in Wasoon, but there's a few of us left up here, and we still follow the Machinato Vitae. The machinery of life. I've heard of that. But right now, I'm more interested in machinery, period. So you just make that, 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 that thing of yours work again, okay? You are taking me to the city in the sea. That thing is a Cadillac, and it's not going anywhere without a new tire. Could you open the trunk and get me the spare? Trunk? <laughs> the storage hatch in the back. Oh. Hey, how come I'm doing all the work? Because you shot the tire. So what's your name, old blood? Jack Tenrick, mechanic. Hannah Dundee, diplomat. Diplomat? Isn't that like a politician? Oh, a little bit. I hate politicians. Get in. I'm not really a politician. I, I was sent here to make contact between our cities. What I really am is a scientist. I hate scientists even more than I hate politicians. 
Well, this is the start of a beautiful friendship. Whoa! He did a great job rebuilding the, um, what did you call it again? A Cadillac. A Cadillac. <laughs> What's this thing? <laughs> a radio. A radio? You know, we're trying to learn to broadcast again in Wasoon. Have you done it here? Yeah, but we only have one station. I don't think you'd like it. Fellow citizens, I implore you to learn from our own uh. history. The days when the mechanics were important to our survival were almost a century ago. We don't need advice from that obsolete breed today. Who's that? Wilhelmina Scharnhorst. She's one of the three governors in the city in the sea. If she had her way, she'd be the only governor, and I'd be run out of town. Jack Tenrick and his mechanic friends are relics. They are the real dinosaurs. By telling us we can't build where we want to and plant where we want to, they are slowing progress. They are stopping development. They are taking food out of the mouths of your children. Well, that was mature. Now you're just gonna have to fix it. No problem. Here's my garage. Garage? It's, it's more like a fortress. Jack! You had us all worried. We heard about that rampaging shivet. Who's this? Mustafa Cairo, meet Hannah Dundee, a scientist and a diplomat from the city of Wasoon. Wasoon, huh? We heard there was another tribe of survivors somewhere south of here. Good to finally meet one. Mustafa, we have to find that shivet before it does more damage. Let's see, it wrecked this settlement here. I tracked it to here. It's like it really wants to go back up to the foothills. But each time it starts to head that way, something makes it turn back. Ah! Oh, no, you don't. Not this time. You know very well what you did in here yesterday. Now you march right back outside, and you don't come back inside until you understand the difference between inside and outside. Uh, it's okay, Ambassador. That's just Hermes. Jack raised him after his mama got killed by poachers. He wouldn't harm a fly. But don't tell anyone. He's the best burglar alarm in the business. Yeah, he sure alarmed me. Well, before anything else with Claus shows up, I think I'll be going. Um, is there a boat to the city, or do I have to swim? There's Kurgo's ferry. He runs over twice a day. Should be along soon. Oh, uh-huh. I think I see a smoke. Smoke? You're looking toward the land, not the sea. Mustafa, the scope. Quahoon, it's back. What are you gonna do? Something I swore I would never do. Turn my back on the Machinatio Vitae. I'm going with you. So am I. I don't want an audience. Disastrous! Shh! Quiet, Toulouse. There's more. Giant shivet rampaging through settlement. Weapons useless. Please save us. Hard to believe. All these years, Tenric and the mechanics have said we had nothing to fear from the great beasts. We've based all our plans and expansions on his creed. What do we do now? Now? Now we build where we want. Clear forests, drain rivers, cut down any living thing that stands in our way. Jack Tenrick's philosophy is finished, and so is he. What a glorious, glorious day. Unless you live in that settlement. If you're gonna sit on the council with me, Governor Dahlgren, you'd better get a grip on that sentimental street. You were 
wrong, Tenrek. It's back. I know what has to be done. Just stay out of my way. Not let his tribe be destroyed either. Sorry. I never thought I'd use a lethal dose of tranquilizer. to find a dead Shivet, not a half-dead mechanic. That animal was on a rampage because it was suffering from this. It was making a high-pitched sound. I could barely hear it, but it was driving the Shivet crazy. It's a short-range receiver. Looks like a high-frequency rig. And whoever's been sending that signal to enrage the Shivet has got to be very close. You're doing it wrong! Hands off! Hammer left me in charge. I'm doing it right. Yeah? Then how come we don't hear the Shivet wrecking the village no more? Where's the Shivet? It's gone! Those idiots! Wrench! Vice! You morons! What did you do? They messed with the machinery of life, Hammer. And I guess they got caught in the gears. Ten. It's been a long time. Well worth the wait. You're tough for a girl. You're slow. For a boy. Tired of wrecking villages on your own? Had to use a helpless animal? Whatever works, Tenric. Ugh. You and your brothers are too dense to come up with that transmitter yourselves. You're working for Sharnhorst, aren't you? Trying to discredit me. I work for myself. And I don't want you discredited. I want you terminated. Ah! <laughs> 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 Hmm. I think you've killed your last animal, robbed your last settler. I think you're wrong. Wahoom! Yeah, 
My career is just getting started, Cadillac. And after I finish you, there won't be anything left to stop me. You're forgetting one thing, Hammer. That shivet you tormented. It has your scent. It's gonna seek you out. Find you. Your old blood fairy tales don't scare me, Tenric. No? I'm talking ten tons of fairy tale, Hammer. I'm talking fangs a foot long and claws like steel hooks. When that shivet finds you, what's left of you won't even be a smear on the forest floor. I wonder if you'll be one bite. Or maybe two. Guess we'll know in a minute. <laughs> Convincing? Sure fooled me. <laughs> Come on, let's go. There's someone I gotta talk to. You know what a transmitter is, don't you, Sharnhorst? That's what made that shiver destroy those settlements. You should treat it more gently. I also know that the only place the Turhoons could get one would be from you or your moles. The city council knows it too. They'll remove you from the board of governors when I show them that evidence. Evidence? What evidence? I know you don't believe in the Machinatio Pitae, but I'll give it to you anyway. In a nutshell, what goes around comes around. And when it's your turn to go, I'll be around. So, how'd it go? That well, huh? Until next time, Tenrek. Until next time, Shardhorst. <laughs> <laughs>